Hey guys, welcome to the channel. Today, we are opening up some allure. There's tons of rookie card stuff, parallels and inserts. There's your standard base rookies. There's your top 50 rookies. There's your die cut rookies. There's a bajillion parallels to every card in this set. But Clance, you said you didn't like allure. You said it was garbage. You said, I quote, Overpriced. Prepare for disappointment. Five packs per box. Six cards in a pack. Come on, Pepper Jack. Shiny. Shiny. 30 bucks for five packs of cards. It's just not worth it. I'd recommend going for the hobby box. The hobby box. I just paid 30 bucks for five packs. The value's just not there. It's a product I'm gonna not bother with. I actually think I like platinum better. Well, that was when I opened up the retail box. Today we're opening up the hobby box. You're gonna get a lot more stuff in this. We're actually guaranteed an autograph card we have a chance of getting patches, jerseys, autograph patches, autograph jerseys, autograph tags. In the box, we get eight packs. In each pack, we get six cards. Uh... Yeah, that'll do. This is a weird box. I think it, oh, there's tape. For a non-premium product, they sealed this pretty good. There, that's supposed to fold out and, yeah, displayed. Eight packs. So there is potential to get some really cool stuff in this. And they have a lot of options for set building, whether you're collecting a single player or a team or the type of card. So here's the base. Very reflective stuff. You can really see the dirt on it. Here's Vanen. Here's our top 50, Ryan Paling. I gotta be careful with this reflective stuff. I don't wanna reveal my face. Not yet. Cool, we have a jersey, a rookie jersey, Zach McEwen. That's pretty dope. Rainbow uh, foil on the inside and uh, red on the outside. I guess you'd call that the border, but. Yeah, red rainbow jersey, Zach McEwen. Nice. Base, uh, oh no, sorry, rookie, Wallstrom, base, O'Reilly. So I do, I compare Allure a lot to Platinum, Upper Deck Platinum. But the one thing I prefer about Platinum is the autographs are hard signed. They're signed right on the cards. I'm 99% sure you don't get hard signed cards in this. They're all sticker signatures, so. Another rookie, Dante Fabro. John Tavares. Uh, this is a pink, matte pink. Rookie, Les Barrance. Is it a matte pink? Like, it looks like it, but it doesn't say it on the back. Maybe it's a short print or something. I'll throw it up on the screen when I find out, if I find out. Uh, so here's a die cut card. Matt Barzell. Uh, this is the orange slice. Pretty nice looking. Numbered to 199. Ryan Paling, rookie. Noah Dobson, rookie. Another huge hit card in Allure is the Golden Treasures, which are numbered to one. I believe some of them are autographed and some of them even have patches or jerseys. Uh, Patrick Kane, base. Top 50, Brandon Gignac. 
white rainbow die cut of Henrik Lundqvist. Max Jones rookie, Rasmus Sandin rookie, Zach Sanishin rookie. You do get a lot of rookie cards in that, in the packs. We are expecting one autograph here. I had some audio technical difficulties, so I lost most of the audio recording on my computer. Fortunately, my phone microphone picked it all up, but unfortunately, it's probably gonna sound like Enjoy. Doughty. It's a winter storm warning. Insert Rasmus Dallin. Oh, we got our autograph. Eric Brandstrom. On his top 50, rainbow foiled. Mark Giordano, Max Domi. One day I'm gonna learn how to open these packs without having a reef on them. John Gibson, Colton Perenko, Guillaume Brisebois, top 50 rookie, Ethan Bastion, Red die cut, red rainbow die cut. Anders Lee, Nico Sturm. Three more packs. I'd like to get something else in this. We got a jersey, we got an autograph. Both of not so fabulous players. Matt Murray, Max Verano, Joel Farabee, rookie. I believe this is a short print version. Mark Giordano, that's a white rainbow. Victor Olofsson, rookie. Phil Kessel. Okay, I think I have, I think I figured out how to open the packs properly without looking like a weakling. Rookie of Rem Pitlick. Braden Point. Top 50 Jack Hughes. We got a blue, ooh, a blue. We'll save that for last. I believe blue is numbered and it's pretty rare. I think it's to 100. I think they're numbered to 100, so let's see. Jake Gensel, Nikita Gusev, and we have, it's not Sanishin again, is it? It is. Nice looking card. I love the blue, I love the rainbow. It's a crazy pattern. Blue line is what that's called. Uh, yeah, number to 25. Wow, okay. Not bad. Very cool. Last pack. Got another die cut. Maybe another auto. Henrik Lundqvist. Alex Ovechkin. Jacob Vrena. Ah, uh, cool. Open ice. Is this Stamkos? Steve Stamkos. That's actually a really cool insert. Whoop! Oh! It's all really foily. It looks much better in real life than in the photographs. Is it numbered? No. What else? Cool. Then we got a white rainbow Ben Bishop. And Alex Barkov. So aside from the base cards that we got, we got a lot here. We had a pink rookie. I believe these are short print. Joel Esperance. 
We got our auto of Eric Brandstrom there. Top 50 on the rainbow foil. We've got our limited to 25 Zach Sanation. That is a nice card. This is probably my favorite looking one. At least in this box. We pulled die cut red rainbow rookie card. We got our jersey card, Zach McEwen. We got our open ice, a stammer there. This is a really cool card. We got some more die cuts of the white rainbow. Uh, orange peel or orange slice, orange slice. Half bar Zell, our top 50 rookie inserts. We got our regular rookies. And we got a short print of Faraby there, and we got our Winter Storm Warning. Rasmus Dahlin. So that was a lot. For the price of that, I'm way more happy with this than with the blaster box that I bought at Walmart of Allure. That was just, no. No, thank you. No, no, no. This was way better. Even though we didn't pull any big name autos or patches or stuff, it's still a solid box. And like I said before, just huge potential for set building. You can collect all the top 50s. You can collect one player, all their inserts and parallels. There's so many, just of the die cut ones alone. So super fun box to open this time around. I mean, it was the hobby box compared to the retail blaster, but that was awesome. I approve. So that's it, that's all I got guys please hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't already and we'll have more awesome hockey content coming to you in the near future